द एशिया कप फीवर इज ऑन बट वन प्लेस इन कोलम्बो दैट्स अ मस्ट विजिट फॉर एवरी क्रिकेट लवर बट नॉट ओनली क्रिकेट लवर बट एवरी स्पोर्ट्स फैन यू कैन सी बिहाइंड मी द लिस्ट ऑफ मेमोरेबलिया द लिस्ट ऑफ कलेक्शन दिस प्लेस हैज वी आर टॉकिंग अबाउट क्रिकेट क्लब कैफे एंड विद मी इज कैबी हु हैज बिल्ट इट फ्रॉम स्क्रैच इट्स अ जर्नी ऑफ मेनी डिकेट्स एंड दैट हैज लिवड अप टू द एक्सपेक्टेशन ऑफ एवरी क्रिकेट लवर एंड एंड हैज बिकम अ मस्ट विजिट प्लेस बट हाउ डिड इट ऑल स्टार्ट हाउ वेर डिड दिस जर्नी स्टार्ट We started the Cricket Club Cafe back in 1996. Uh we felt that Asia was the correct place to uh bring the cafe um and we feature every test playing nation around the world with original memorabilia. Uh of course when we arrived we had a lot of Australian memorabilia. Uh we had a bit of India, a bit of Pakistan, a bit of Sri Lanka, but as we established ourselves in Colombo, uh the test playing nations and uh, cricket team started visiting us and fell in love with the cafe then also wanted their jerseys on the walls so that's how we also built up our collection by having cricket teams visit us uh, it's an absolute thrill as i said we started back in 1996 and we've just really gone from strength to strength over the years and we're always so thrilled when uh, players come to town and come and visit the cafe and it's just a marvelous atmosphere when the when the cricket's on so as you said we've got the asian cup going on here at the moment. Unfortunately a little bit of rain has delayed things here and there but we're looking forward to the finals. And uh Sri Lanka is such a an open, you know, country to come and enjoy it and yeah, it's it's really exciting time for us to have all the teams here in Colombo. Absolutely and not only for cricket lovers as Gabby said, it is a place which is extremely popular with cricketers also. Who are the some of the players, big name players you you loved when they visited here in your cafe? So of course being Australian Australia was my number one uh people that I wanted to visit so from Shane Warne, Steve Warne, Mark Warne, Glenn McGrath, Ricky Ponting uh and then of course some of the the modern day players like uh St- uh, Warner and and so forth. Um it's always a thrill when we have people from India. Uh we're really excited when Indian cricketers come to the cafe because they have so many friends in Sri Lanka it's sometimes difficult to get them here. But I've over the years I've had Ravi Shastri, Robin Singh. Um excited to have uh KL Rahul. He was one of my last visitors to the cafe. And I sat down and had a lovely chat with him. Uh he was very so sweet. He really was so sweet. and it was a thrill for me to meet him also did someone uh, recommend kl rahul to visit this cafe it was actually doni who told him that he had to come down here so i was thrilled to know that doni knew about us as well so he'll have to come and visit us as well sometime and and uh, any other uh, present cricketer you would uh, wish they come here like virat kohli or rohit sharma or jaspreet bumrah anyone from this lot absolutely i would love rohit sharma because i feature him on my cricket club menu yes uh, as sharma satay burger so one day i'd love him to come down and try it um and of course any of them virat kohli it would be a, a, an absolute pleasure and of course not to forget the great man himself sachin tendulkar you know we would love to see him here we have a lot of memorabilia uh where we feature india um and all the greats of indian players so i'd love them to come and see what we've done and how we've displayed their famous memorabilia and i won't uh, keep it very long i'll keep it very brief any fun incident with when the players have come which you have kept it in your mind and will forever stay with you <laughs> there are so many instances but we have a we have a ruling cricket club whatever happens in the cricket club stays in the cricket club but yes there have been fun and games and uh from drinking games to tuk tuk races into the cricket club and just generally we we want the players to let their hair down and it not be posted on social media in a certain way so we uh we try and look after the players and of course there's always fans around that want photographs but we just make sure we have all the players fed and watered and then usually they they're more than happy to get put give some signatures to kids and mm-hmm. and fans that visit the cafe and uh, my final question you have so much i think it, this place has everything you wish as a cricket lover but one memorabilia one memento which you would want to add to this collection anything that you dream of 
Probably some more India stuff. Yeah. India, Sri Lanka, and some of the, like, T20. I, I really don't have enough T20 and nothing from Asia Cup, so we'd be excited to feature some of the more modern-day day cricket memorabilia. That would be marvellous, yeah. And any message for all the fans who are watching this who are in Colombo for the Asia Cup to come here and, and experience this? It's I call it a museum. It's not a cafe. It's a museum. To experience this, any message to the fans? Please, whenever you're in Colombo, come and visit me at the Cricket Club Cafe. We, our doors are open, our hearts are open, and we're ready to serve you. So we'd love to see you. Cheers. Thank you so much. Thank you so much, Gabby. It was a lovely chat. This is a place, Cricket Club Cafe. You, if you are in Colombo, it's a must visit for Asia Cup, for later, for any time you wish to come. So enjoy the glimpses of this beautiful cafe. It's a museum, as I said. And stay tuned to Rev Sports for all the coverage related to Asia Cup. Thank you so much.